You have entered the Plumbing Business Success Zone, teaching entrepreneurs the business of plumbing. This is Potty Talk Live, recorded live on Facebook every week. And now your host, Richard Bainey, the Million Dollar Plumber. Every company I've ever known changes their commission program. Yep. Constantly and as soon as you change up on the guys, mm -hmm. As soon as you change it up on your guys, you lose the trust on the majority. Now, again, this, who, this the guy that uh, said that he likes to commission, you may be, you're that one guy, okay? So you'll go, you'll deal with it and figure out how to play that game and make the most out of that game. Mm -hmm. Most of all the other guys are freaking out, or they just said they don't understand it. They changed it up on me. To hell with it. I'm just going to go do my day, blah, right. blah, blah. Okay, right. all right? Mm -hmm. Whereas with peace rate, and we're getting to this, mm -hmm. I never changed it up in 18 years. Nope. Never, you never had to change, you know, mm -hmm. so, so the trust is there. Right. right. Okay. Um, and the guys need more. Yeah. Uh, one more. Jesse has a question. He said, big question of the day. Um, you want to have apprentices. How do you pay them? Do you pay them um, from the service tax pay? Nope. Good question. They're included. That's but a great, great question. question okay. Um, um, your apprentices and help, that kind of stuff is built into your hourly rate. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, that's built into that price of that time that you're selling. So yeah, let's get to that, okay? Yeah. So before we get to that here, okay. I got something for you for watching, for hanging with me here. Yeah. All okay. right, mm -hmm. um, something, something for you. Hey, you, you got, even got the thing there. All right, my free ebook, The Seven Most Knows, to be a million dollar plumber. Mm -hmm. We go over the concepts like this, okay, and others that you got to know to have a successful, self sustaining, and very profitable business, okay? So my, my free ebook, The Seven Must Knows, mm -hmm. all right, put you on the path of it, just that, okay? Type seven in the comments to get it. Mm -hmm. All right, and it's free. All right, mm -hmm. so check it out. Yep. Or if you're listening to the podcast, go to the million dollar plumber.com forward slash seven. All right, seven. grab it. All right, my gift to you. Mm -hmm. So, okay, so what do we have left here? Okay, peace rate. Peace rate. Peace rate. I'm what kind of PR. funky voodoo PR. talk are you? Peace rate. Hey, peace rate's about. not just something that I pulled out of my butt or it's just, that's new. <laughs> okay, all right, and with peace rate. Everybody in the Success Academy and our clients mm -hmm. are giving you heart bombs and okay. thumbs up. So there we yes. go. Mm -hmm. Peace rate. Peace rate's been around since about the fifties. Mm -hmm. Okay, it comes from the automotive industry. It does, and somebody already mentioned that earlier. Okay, I you know, I, I knew this. I, mm -hmm. I know how I knew about it mm -hmm. because my father was a mechanic. Mm -hmm. Okay, I grew up in a blue collar home. My dad was a mechanic. Yep. In fact, for a period of time, he was known as like the best uh, uh, tune-up man in town. Mm -hmm. And for a period of time, we lived pretty decent. Hey, John. Until the factory, the manufacturer started messing with peace, their peace rate mm -hmm. because the guys like my dad started making good money and saying, well, mechanics aren't worth that. Okay, mm -hmm. we shouldn't pay that mechanics that much. It's the same goes. I had, argue, I had guys, my, my competition in town, you go to the meetings and that stuff, and they find out my guys are making, you know, uh, pushing six figures and making more than six figures. Mm -hmm. I had my guys saying, you can't pay your guys that. You can't pay that. Why not? I'm selling the time. We're going to get to that. We they can were making whatever uh, we want. Right. We're the boss of us. Okay. Mm -hmm. So that's what happened. So it, it, um, to my to my dad. Now they came from the automotive industry. So mm -hmm. they they're trying to figure out how how to get more time because mm -hmm. they understood what they were selling, time, and to incentivize their guys to work quicker. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. To to free up. Okay, more stalls in the service department. So you know you can only build out so far, and you couldn't build up. Right, mm -hmm. they couldn't. They, they, could, they couldn't build up, right. so they wanted to get more time out of these service stalls. So they created peace rate, okay? Mm -hmm. So they could pay guys, okay, like my dad, okay. Or you pay your guy twenty five dollars an hour, right? Okay. So you assign them an hourly rate. They get an hourly rate, right. an hourly pay. Well, an hourly rate. An, an hourly rate, okay. Yeah. So I I get paid twenty five dollars an hour, mm -hmm. okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. But then, then, for the job, just like with my dad, with uh, the, the tune-up, it paid like an hour and a half or two hours to do the tune-up or something like that. Mm -hmm. Back in the day, we you know, replaced plugs and that kind of stuff. Right. And my dad can do them in like 45 minutes to an hour. Mm -hmm. So he was sell they were selling that time, those two hours for that tune-up, mm -hmm. okay, to the customer. was are selling that time, those two hours, but the tech is doing it in half the time, half the time, mm -hmm. thus, thus creating more time for the company to sell. So going back to the thing to the, the, the um, you know the guy that said about time in the house, mm -hmm. it's not so much of having eight hours in the house, right. but selling sixteen hours and being in the house five hours or six right. hours. Okay, and that's not overselling. Nope. Okay. Not. 
but it's selling that time, okay, mm -hmm. and that the technician then moving quicker, mm -hmm. okay? Because what right. do you know might even incentivize your technician. So really, mm -hmm. it's this plus a multiple, <laughs> right? So you're mu you can multiply it, okay? Mm -hmm. So it's a multiple. Thus, that truly in incentivizes your incentivizes your plumber, okay? And you want these kinds of plumbers, right? You want you you, you want these kinds of the kind of plumbers that want to make more money, mm -hmm. okay? That that, that love that idea and it's an easier thing to understand because okay, you're gonna pay me twenty five dollars an hour or you're, yeah, the, okay you're, that's, my, that's, that's my that's my pay so I'm, a, I'm a plumber right so I'm, I've, I've been in front of guys like this a lot okay hundreds of guys yes okay hey, Preston says commission with less steps I love it Ex exactly there's way to Maui as we speak there we go there's no thinking okay there's no thinking for your guys Right. It's this clear. Mm -hmm. So you're going to pay me $25 an hour? Yep, you got to pay $25 an hour. Mm -hmm. And I'd ask them, well, how, how long does it take you to install a, a water heater? And you know, guys, you know, guys, a standard water heater, if you're decent, okay, mm -hmm. standard water heater, you know, electric, gas, really doesn't matter, okay? Right. Standard water heater. Okay. Hey, it, Carmen. Even, even a, a regular guy say, well, I'm, you know, I can get one in you know, an hour and a half. Mm -hmm. Maybe, you know, and they won't say this, but two hours if I'm coasting, okay? Right. But an hour and a half. And guys, when it really goes well, you can do it an hour. If you got your water heater there, that kind of thing. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Come okay. on. Yeah. All right? Mm -hmm. So I say, well, we pay, and our, we pay three hours to do that water heater. I pay three hours to do that water heater. Mm -hmm. So you would get three hours times your, your pay. hourly rate. And see, a guy, can, a guy can get that. So it's $25 times three. Mm -hmm. $25 times three. Right. And so the question I'd get next is, well, what if it takes me an hour and a half? It really does. Mm -hmm. Get three hours. Well, what if it takes me two hours? You three get hours. paid three hours. Okay. Mm -hmm. What if it takes me three hours? Three, three hours. hours. Mm -hmm. What if it takes me four hours? Three hours. Three hours. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's, mm -hmm. the, that's the beauty. That's the incentivizing there. That's the protection for the company. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, so it, it pushes them. All right. Mm -hmm to look at the job Perform. correctly correct oh, okay mm -hmm. or if the guy decides it's a beautiful spring day mm -hmm. all right the grass is green the orange and palm trees sway <laughs> you know and it's like the birds are singing mm -hmm. you got you got little cartoon animals coming up right. and singing to you and you're whistling <laughs> <laughs> right. all right okay. and the guy decides to take it easy mm -hmm. all right and take his time you as a company are not hurt by that right. okay you're not penalized and the customer isn't penalized because mm -hmm. that's the greatest fear when, it, when we start talking money with the customer. Mm -hmm. Believe me, the customer knows how long you're spending in the truck and how long mm -hmm. you were away at, at, at the beginning parts. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. So when it's, when it's flat rate, instead of, you know, just charging hourly. Okay. You know, there's, there's flat rate in there now. That's another to topic here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Right. But all right. You, you know, the customer isn't, it feels more secure. Absolutely. Okay. Yeah, because then they know exactly what what it's going to cost. Right. Right. Exactly right. what it's going to cost. Okay. Uh -huh. So so and basically, we do have questions coming in too. They can give themselves a raise. Mm -hmm. So what I saw with my guys. Jesse, I see your question. While so we'll get to it. So mm -hmm. your your guys can go. So if you're paying a guy twenty five dollars an hour and he does the job in less than less than half the time or half the time, mm -hmm. which is how most of the things are set up to do. Okay. All right, you don't want to, we don't create these times to where it's the exact perfect situation and what you would do it in, mm -hmm. okay? Right. You take, you take the average, okay? Right, exactly. So, all right, so the guy can give himself a $50 an hour, you know, he can give himself a raise. Mm -hmm. he, he's in control of his environment, his destiny. You see yeah. what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Okay, it's a beautiful thing. It is so beautiful. That's why I had guys, you know, I had guys that, uh, you know, the record in my company was a guy sold 24 hours in one day and he was home by 5.30. Okay, because we did things like we sold a sewer job, we got paid, got paid 16 hours, okay? Mm -hmm. But we subbed out the, the sewer work. You see what I'm, you see mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Yep. So my guy got 16 hours just for selling that job. Mm -hmm. So my guys were begging for the main line machine and the camera, for the guys that, that, that love this, mm -hmm. okay? Yep. All right, so they would get that 16 hours and while the dig crew, while your dig crew is doing the job, mm -hmm. okay, that's built into your hourly rate, your, those, you know, your dig guys and all that kind of stuff, your hourly guys are built into your hourly rate, okay, as an expense, okay? Right. Um, 
why those guys are doing the work or a sub, we use the sub. We always use the sub. Okay. Mm -hmm. My guy got 16 hours for that. And so he was now doing a water heater call or, you know, another, you know, some kind of uh, well, repair. Yep. While the big crew was doing why he's making time doing that right he's also making other additional time in mm -hmm. his day and he just created time for our company and he created more time for the company Correct. see how that works mm -hmm. with that there's no there's no babysitting mm -hmm. there's no driving mm -hmm. this is freedom buddy that put maui that's what that means right that there maui m-a-u-i that's maui for you maui okay <laughs> that's the only way to maui mm -hmm. to really be able to um live what we call the freedom lifestyle. Right. And the bottom line, that's what we're all about here. You know, the Million Dollar Plumber is Million about plumber. Uh, Potty Talk Live. We're talking the freedom lifestyle, right. not manage the plumbing business lifestyle, mm -hmm. okay? There's nothing wrong with that if that's, mm -hmm. what, that's what you wanna do, okay? Right. But if you're looking for the freedom lifestyle, mm -hmm. all right, to create an asset that, that gives you uh, security, all right, right. And, and wealth, which is financially and mm -hmm. time, okay? Increase that freedom lifestyle, Peace rate is the only way you can do it for yourself. It's the fairest way to provide true opportunity for your guys. If you truly right. love your men and really mm -hmm. truly care about your men, if you're doing anything else, a little mm -hmm. bit full of BS, okay? Mm -hmm. Or just don't, just don't know, it's okay? It's just too hard. Okay. Okay, we got a lot of questions. All right. Million Dollar Plumber. Let's bring it. What do you got? All right, let's see. Let me, where in the world do we start? Um, let's see. Peace rate. Blah, 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 blah. Jesse. Um, he's going to the water heater example. And Jesse, these are great questions too. Um, but every water heater is different. We have direct fence yeah. here that can take you longer. Certainly. Yes. So you charge more. Right. So we, we, did, we had them here too. Power they have, they have them all over the, you know. Mm -hmm. All right, direct fence. Um, you're going to have some that are in a stand. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, difficult access, like, right. um, you know, you got the water softener and the gas is all in front of them, so you got to take it apart. So you're going to have, in your flat rate pricing, you're going you're gonna to have a task for. Um, a standard water heater installation. Mm -hmm. um, one, you're gonna have a direct vent, okay? Mm -hmm. um, our 75 gallon gas water heaters were more expensive than the 50, not just because they, we charge, because they cost more for the materials, <laughs> okay, right. and the water heater itself, mm -hmm. because it took two men and a boy, you know, to, to get, you know, <laughs> you know, take care of it, okay? Right. So the bottom line is you're selling that time, okay? Mm -hmm. And you wanna position it. Um, for example, um, our power vent water heaters, starting from scratch, okay, mm -hmm. um, paid 15 hours. Okay, but a good guy once he did one and got it in and was on top of it, move it, mm -hmm. could install one in six hours, seven hours, take the whole day when he's coasting. Mm -hmm. Well, the bottom line is, I gladly let him coast and take the whole day. My guys that made six figures would get it in as fast as possible That's and take right. a job at the end of the day. Absolutely. Okay, because they, he got 15 hours. Mm -hmm. Okay, he got 15 hours, but he sold those 15 hours. He, so mm -hmm. the company got. He, he, he's actually sold another a day. He gave himself a raise. He, he gave himself a raise. Right. Exactly. Okay. I hope that makes sense. John um, Matthews. Hi, John. Wants to know about overtime. No, this this is the overtime. We mm -hmm. had guys that um, um, now here here's here's the thing that, that you'll want to do. Okay. Mm -hmm. You'll you'll see that you're going to be paying guys. Um, you know, we had guys that you know, we paid in a two week cycle. Well, we'll keep it easy on a forty week. Okay, or mm -hmm. you know, one week cycle. You're going to have guys that do sixty seventy hours sell 60 70 hours okay mm -hmm. but they're but they're only working until five and six mm -hmm. okay they're home by six right. you see what i'm saying right all right mm -hmm. now with today's because of like california mm -hmm. um going you know the, the socialist concern look the <laughs> states um the states want to keep guys enslaved they're not looking to support business uh states like california mm -hmm. um new york, new york um illinois, illinois okay mm -hmm are truly looking to enslave their people. Mm -hmm. they're, they're about slavery, okay? Yep. They don't want guys going out and starting business, okay? Mm -hmm. um, and so they say, well, we wanna make sure guys get paid. Well, what, you'll need, what you need to do now, and even California um, for, um, Alex. for Alex, mm -hmm. look, you, even, you can go, you can charge piece rate, but you gotta keep track of the actual time they work now Okay, so say the guy, so if the state, if you ever had, did the state did come and audit you, all right? So I'd be doing this now too, even in, 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 uh, in Indiana, okay? Mm -hmm. um, which we're a right to work state, okay? Mm -hmm. But you know it's coming, okay? You, you, you know it's, it's coming this way. Mm -hmm. So what you'd wanna be able to do, you'd have to keep track of their actual hours worked. So you'd wanna use something like, you know, a sky boss, where um, with the time clock with the time clock in feature. it, okay, yep. time clock feature, mm -hmm. so that you get you got your guys clocking in and out, mm -hmm. so that you could show to the state that um, so say a guy worked really he clocked um, you know 
45 hours. Mm -hmm. And so, and that kind of guy, you'd have to pay his 40 hours at minimum wage right. and then five hours at time and a half of the minimum wage, right? Correct. So you have to be able to show the state that, that you paid him 60 hours, mm -hmm. okay, at $25 an hour, mm -hmm. that that pay was greater because the state's going to want you to pay the most, right. whatever the greater, Whichever greatest is greater. pay, okay? you pay the most. So Correct. you can say that, hey, this pay um, by, by going by your you know, minimum wage here and all mm -hmm. that was only this much, but I paid him this much. Right. Okay. Yep. Does that make sense? Um, yeah, it does. And, oh, I want to hold on that. Um, uh, let's see. Works plumbing. Um, Patrick, I'm assuming that's Patrick, actual time, and then the rest would be considered a bonus. And you can do that too. Right. That's how we did it. So that's how you would do it too. So Correct. that 40 hours when you send it over to your payroll company, because uh -huh. guys, look, here's mm -hmm. the thing. If you talk to any accountant, accountants don't think outside the box. Certainly anyone in government, mm -hmm. anyone in government doesn't mm -hmm. think outside the box. Right. Who's ever in government is that kid that you knew in grade school um, <laughs> that wanted to be the hall monitor. OK, or the crossing guard. Mm -hmm. OK, that's who's in government. Mm -hmm. All right. And so they don't think outside the box. Mm -hmm. So if you go to them and say, I'm paying peace rate. OK, or even this is how I'm doing it. They don't even they can't comprehend that. Well, mm -hmm. you've got to pay them for all the hours that they work. Well, you got to pay them. <laughs> Do they say it? That OK, way? they say it just like that. OK, <laughs> you got to pay them. All right. And, and so don't try to ask permission in this case mm -hmm. because they'll they'll tell you no right. or in some or they won't even understand or they it. won't even understand even it, understand which it. then will freak you out. Mm -hmm. OK. And you'll, right. you'll be scared. OK. Right. What, what you do is when you send it into your payroll company. Mm -hmm. So say your guy gets 60 hours for the week. Mm -hmm. OK. You're going to do 40 hours. So you can say, hey, Joe gets 40 hours at $25 an hour. Mm -hmm. He gets his 40 hours at his pay. Right. And then I'm going to bonus him. So you'd figure up that other 20 hours times 25. Mm -hmm. So what's that, 500 bucks? I'm bonusing Joe 500 <laughs> bucks. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. So you'd pay for the 40. Say, hey, well, I'm paying for Joe had 40 hours, and I'm giving him a $500 bonus. Mm -hmm. Okay? That's how you do it. Yep. Um, and Alex Mart says, um, hold on a second. Yes, they do sound like that. <laughs> they sound just like that. You can't do that. <laughs> You got to pay them where they, how they work. <laughs> All right, Preston, who's okay. trying to get to Maui. So let's hurry up and get Preston to Maui here. Um, what is he saying? So the only, the only way, uh, where's it? So the only way someone could pay with piece rate is to use the flat rate charging, correct? Which uh, that's the way because you can figure out because you're selling time. Mm -hmm. So to make sure because what you're doing, if I sell three hours for this water heater, you're, mm -hmm. you're selling that water heater, that time, that's built into that flat rate, flat rate price to your customer. Right. Okay, I mean, you can figure it up an hour on the go, that kind of a no, thing, oh, it's but, too but you don't want to do that. It's you not gonna get you to Maui. It's not gonna get you to Maui, and your guys aren't gonna do it. Right, so his, his question is, um, so you need a price book, correct? Yes, yeah. where could a company get a price book? Hmm. You want your own price book, okay? And I'm not going to be self-serving here, but that's mm -hmm. something we cover in the, in the in academy, the academy, okay? Mm -hmm. hey, if you're truly serious about growing your plumbing business and learning this kind of stuff and you're looking for freedom, mm -hmm. uh, you need the academy. There's nothing, el you need it. nothing else out there like it, mm -hmm. um, need it uh, affordable, it. okay? Mm -hmm. uh, and I got a 14-day free trial for you. So that's you one do. of the first things we do early on is mm -hmm. you create your own flat rate pricing, not getting it from one of these systems or someone else. You got it, guys, the freedom is understanding your numbers. Not that someone says, well, we're gonna put in your hourly rate and we'll do the blah, blah, blah. No, you put together, it's gonna to be the hardest, hardest thing you do. Thing I'll, you be, do I'll be straightforward with you here. Yeah. I, I wanna scare you. You, you, wanna be, you wanna be a pro, mm -hmm. you want freedom, mm -hmm. you, you, got, you gotta do this work.